May 19th. <laughs> this might possibly be one of my shortest videos here. Um, I have to uh, I have to say this to you guys to let you know this. To listen, I've got an angel that blows a trumpet over my head. Okay, now I share this with you. I share the clock, the white horse, and the bathtub over at the end of the trumpet. But let me tell you something, okay? In no means does Jesus Christ ever put words into my mouth to tell you to uh, that this is what he said, this or that. Because he left us the written word of God. It's in the King James Version. And it's in that Bible. If anybody ever tells you, oh, the Lord came to me and he told me to tell you this. Please be careful of this. Be very careful. This written word right here that we see here, let me tell you, and this is the truth. One day to the Lord is like a thousand years to us. He was just here two days ago. I promise you, everything he wanted to say is right here. He didn't forget to say anything. It's all right here. Don't be deceived, please. Please. You know, if the Lord wanted you to know something further, um, it, it's all right here. I promise you. It's in the written word of God. Don't be deceived. There's a lot of people out there, and he warned you in this book about that, too, being deceived. Now, do you think he's going to give people messages to tell you now, even after he told you not to be deceived? These people that are telling you all this stuff. Look, I've got an angel above my head blowing a trumpet, okay? I'm telling you, do not be deceived, okay? I'm not telling you nothing that's not written in the Word of God, okay? Only thing I am saying is, I'm telling you, this is for me. I'm telling you not to get caught up in this gender bathroom issue stuff, not to get caught up in who's the next president, I'm telling you not to deny the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. And I'm telling you what's written in the Word of God right here. <clears throat> I'm telling you clearly what I'm saying. I'm not saying the Lord told me to tell you anything like that. Anybody that says that the Lord's saying to say this or that and it's not coming directly out of here. <clears throat> do I need to tell you anything more? God bless you. Keep the full armor of God on. And please don't let anybody deceive you. These are the final moments. Anytime somebody's writing down saying, oh, the Lord came to me, and they're flipping over pages like this, please, please know this. The Lord got us everything we needed right here, okay? There's a lot of wolves out there, man. These people have sweet-sounding voices. Don't let them deceive you. Please, okay? That angel above my head, it's very true. It's not, I'm not here to lie or deceive you. I'm not trying to say that the Lord told me this or that. I'm telling you to keep it right in here. I'm telling you not to be deceived by these people that are uh, going on about these bathroom issues. We know what's at hand. We know this is the devil, okay? Don't be deceived. This is the final crucial moments. These are the things that they use to get your hearts filled with bitterness, anger, hatred. And you got to let this go. That's why I said, let it go. And then if anybody ever comes on here and says, oh, the Lord came to me and he told me to tell you this. It's right here in the word of God. <clears throat> That's what the Lord wants you to know what's in here. And he told you, don't be deceived. There's going to be many people out there that will deceive you. I mean many. And listen, remember this. Enter ye at the straight gate. For wide is the gate, and broad is that that leadeth to destruction. And many there which go in by thereat. Because straight is the gate, and narrow is the way which leadeth into the uh, life. And few there be that find it. Okay? There's a lot of people. I'm going to tell you something. These people, sweet sounding voices, it's not the person that you think. There's many people that have demons hosting them. It's inside of them, okay? I know this is hard to understand. Jesus Christ said, I am not from this world. 
And these demons aren't either. They're here to take you to hell. Please, don't be deceived, okay? God bless you, and uh, be with the Holy Spirit. I had to get this to you because somebody sent me a clip where somebody was saying that, and I had to shut it off immediately.